Hey guys, I'm Andre the Farmer, and today I'm gonna to talk to you guys about planting pineapples, store-bought pineapples. And I'm gonna show you how I plant them and I get about 100% success rate. This here is a pineapple that I planted about eh, almost two years ago. You can see the pineapple growing on here right now. I'm gonna show you guys how to get your own pineapples, okay? So, first step, you wanna pick a pineapple that's not dead. So if you can pull these leaves out of the center, then your pineapple's probably not ideal for planting. It's gonna be great for eating because it's gonna be super sweet, but it's not gonna be the right one that you want to plant. So if you wanna plant your pineapple, right from the time you get it, you're gonna pick one that's pretty green, and you're also gonna twist off the top right away. You're not gonna wait until the pineapple's ripe because then your top's gonna be dead. So you wanna twist off that top the first thing you do. Sometimes I like to twist it off before I even get it home from the store. I'll just twist it off and put it in the bag. So once you've got to twist it off, all we're going to do is just remove these lower leaves. Now our pineapple is going to ripen without this top. And pineapples don't actually ripen. What they do is they decompose. And that's why you get all the sugars in them and they get super sweet. So I don't like to think of it as decomposing. I think of it as ripening. So I'm going to call it ripening, even though I know technically it's not called ripening. It's not exactly what they do. But for our sakes, ripening. And to ripen it, I am gonna put it upside down and let those sugars get distributed all throughout the whole fruit. So we're gonna put that in a place inside and we're gonna let it sit upside down and that's gonna help it ripen. Now, in the meantime, we've got our, ah, we've got our pineapple end here and we've basically taken off most of the lower branches. We just wanna leave enough exposed. Now there's two ways you can do this. You can leave this out and let it sit for a couple days and let this scab over a little bit. That kind of reduces your chances of it rotting if you live in a really moist, wet climate. Or we can just go ahead and plant this in the ground right now. So all we're gonna do, see if we can find a spot where you guys can see what I'm doing here, is we're just gonna dig a tiny little hole and we're gonna stick that right in the hole. And we're just gonna bury it up to the neck. All we wanna do is give it a little bit of water initially. We're gonna water it directly on the top. After the first couple days, we don't really need to water it anymore. Maybe just once a week if it doesn't rain. But other than that, you're set. And there we go. That's all you gotta to do to plant a pineapple. In about a year and a half to two years, you'll get a pineapple. I have a trick for how you can get pineapples faster. Check out my other videos, all right? If you, hit, if you learned something there, hit the like button, subscribe, all right? See you guys, bye.